Hi and welcome to the Studio One Quick Tip. Recently, we had a question in Persona 3 Expert Chat, and the user asked if it's possible to stop playback automatically at the end of the song. And indeed, it's possible, but it's not an option that you can turn on globally, but you need to add a marker at the position where you like playback to stop. Here's how it works. In your song, open the marker track. You find the marker track if you open this pop-up menu, or if the track controls panel is wide enough, you see the single icons for all the different global tracks here. And here you just click marker track. And now you can either click the plus button to add a new marker, or you press the insert key, which is the default shortcut to insert a new marker. And now here's the trick. Right click the marker, and this will open this little context menu. And here you can not only rename the marker, but you also have this option, stop at marker. And you can probably guess what happens if I turn on this option and start playback. This makes our playback stop as soon as we reach this marker. And this can be very useful not only at the end of the song, but maybe you use Studio One also for live shows. And here it can be very handy to be able to stop at a certain point in the arrangement, for example, after a guitar solo or a break or something like that. And then you can simply start playback again by pressing the space key. Just keep in mind that this does not work with the start or end markers. When you right click them, you don't get the stop at marker option. That's a small limitation that I hope can be improved in the future, but currently you need to add another marker and enable the stop option for that marker. I hope you enjoyed this quick tip. If you found that video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button. And also I'd really appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel. That's it for today. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.